Catch RCN Sports Talk. Now, anywhere, anytime. And I'm anxious to talk to Howie. You know, Howie is capable of a lot, and I'm, I'm going to I'm going to just challenge him. I'm going to challenge Howie and tell him if you want to play more, if you want to play against lefties, you got to show me that you can hit lefties. You got to hit better. And basically, it boils down down to that. And I think he's up for the challenge. I'm anxious for that. I know what kind of guy he is, a true competitor, and I'm going to challenge him to make me put him in the lineup. Cody has not actually lived up to his potential. We think he's a better hitter than he's shown. And it's, I'm anxious to try to get him playing time. Uh, one of the things that I'm big on that's important to me in, in the outfield is coverage. I, I want I want players with speed uh, who can cover a lot of ground in the outfield. And we have basically with Borges, Oduel, and Altair, potential candidates in the outfield. There's three center fielders. They're all good center fielders. That being said, that's the kind of outfielders I'm looking for in the outfield. But right now, Borges has been a, an outstanding center fielder in his career defensively. We think he's going to hit more. I think he's going to hit more than he has in the last few years. Uh, on the other hand, Odubel Herrera impressed me an awful lot. I really liked how he played center field. After the first couple of weeks where he made some blunders, uh, he really looked good out there. And I know that Altair is outstanding in that position. And then you got Roman Quinn in, in, lurking in the shadow somewhere. This guy's ready to, to, to you know, uh, make a name for himself. And Nick Williams, is the cor he's a corner guy. We got this Goodell that we got in the Rule 5 that we like an awful lot. I haven't seen him play, and I'm anxious to see him. But one reason we're po I'm positive is because of the, the pitchers that we acquired. You know, that, that was our biggest problem. Last year, we were out of so many games with, within three or four innings, and we had to climb out of, uh, out of holes, dig ourselves out. Uh, you know, so many games. If we can, if we can minimize that or half that, uh, we're going to win more games. I, you know, I won't etch it in stone. I won't say anybody's a lock, but I sure like what Nola did last year, and I was really impressed with uh, Eikhoff. And uh, those two guys in particular made a real good impression. So, uh, under the circumstances, I would like to think that they're going to be part of the rotations. But you know, you never know what's going to happen in the spring. But I like both of them very much. And then, of course, we signed Morton and uh, and Ellickson and uh, Oberholzer. And I'm anxious to see him. I'm anxious to see Velasquez. I've heard nothing but great things about this kid. And I'm uh, just waiting to to get down to Florida to to see what you know. Hopefully I can agree with that, what everybody told me. Uh, Louis Garcia is in that mix. I mean, his his problem is command, but at the same time, he's got the stuff to be a closer. Uh, you know, and uh, uh, Hinojosa, I, I like Hinojosa. He goes right after hitters. He's had he had a heck of a good year for us. He throws strikes and is and is aggressive uh, with hitters.